The man convicted of shooting and killing Senator Robert Kennedy in 1968 may be one step closer to being released from prison. A two-member California parole board panel voted Friday in favor of Sirhan Sirhan's request for, par for parole. Some of Kennedy's children agree with the board. Sirhan Sirhan has served 53 years of a life sentence. It's now up to California Governor Gavin Newsom or whoever succeeds him to uphold or reject the parole board's decision. Sirhan Sirhan, seen here yesterday in California Department of Corrections and Rehabilitation photos, is now 77 years old. He told the parole board at an online hearing he had little memory of the 1968 assassination, but he must have been responsible for bringing the gun and said, I take responsibility for firing the shots that killed Senator Robert Kennedy in Los Angeles. We are a great country and a selfish country and a compassionate country. Kennedy's believed to have been Sirhan's target because he supported Israel. Sirhan was a Palestinian refugee who had fled Israeli rule and moved to Southern California as a child. Just after midnight on June 5, 1968, Kennedy left the podium and walked through the nearby kitchen. The first shot that rang out that night hit you. Yes. Paul Schrade, a union official, was with him. In and out with a couple of fragments left there. Four bullets hit the senator, one to his head. He was pronounced dead in a Los Angeles hospital the next day. At 24 years old, Sirhan was sentenced to death. But three years later, California's death penalty was abolished. His sentence was reduced to life in prison, making him eligible to seek parole, which he did 16 times. Three of the senator's children have even publicly shown support. My family had a lot of tragedies, but many American families do. We interviewed Robert Kennedy Jr. three years ago after he met with Sirhan. It's hard to believe that Sirhan shot my dad. That leads you to conclude what? And my opinion is really irrelevant. What's important is what the facts say, what the autopsy says, what the ballistic evidence and what the eyewitnesses said. Paul Schrade believes there was a second gunman shooting from behind. So you believe the man who shot you and four other people did not shoot and kill Robert F. Kennedy? We couldn't. He was never in a position to do that after those first two shots. He tried to shoot Robert Kennedy with the first two shots, but missed, but shot me first and missed on the second bullet. The Los Angeles Police Department was charged with the investigation and has disputed all claims of a conspiracy. In a statement yesterday, one parole board commissioner said age is a consideration of parole, and it was part of the review of Sirhan. A couple things stand out, Michelle. Only two Kennedys are, are supporting this, mm -hmm. we should say. And also, this was something that impacted so many people in the country, and actually your family, as, as we know, personally. Yes, I'm forever touched by the story because my father was a delegate, was there that night, I campaigned with him that night, and was the first to get to him as a physician to treat him and treat two other people that night. Etched in his uh, memory of that event, of course, questions for him and so many others, what if? What if that had not happened? And again, this is not a done deal. It's up to the governor right. yeah, at this point. Right. 120 days.